Hello guys, I am back. I've been busy, caught up in real life and work and all that. Got into a new workplace and had to settle in. So that kind of distracted me and took away a lot of my focus uh, and uh, surplus energy to do any videos. But here we are back. Uh, and I just stumbled across this little horror game that just came out at Tony's on Steam. It's pretty cheap, so I thought, you know, why not give it a go? Seems like a nice little game to zoom through as a kind of easy return to <laughs> posting. So yeah, let's just head into the game, see what this is about. I haven't played a horror game in a long time, so let's see how this goes. So walk is all this usual stuff. Pick up, interact, left click, drop item, right click. That's fairly easy to remember, right? I should make some coffee. Actually, I don't drink coffee, but I guess the uh, character does. Wow, look at the quality of graphics here. World news. Is your business Y2K proof? <laughs> okay, I guess this takes place a few years back. Anything we can do here? No? Computer? Do we, do we need a cup? We don't need the cup. Phone? Can we pick it up? I can't pick it up yet. Okay. Guess we just head out. Huh. I'm not ready yet. Okay. Oh, we have a kitchen. And we smoke. Naughty, naughty. Uh, where's the coffee? Coffee bag. Uh, coffee machine. Missing cup. Okay. Um, was it in here? Didn't pay attention to that. Maybe over here. Oh, there's a cup. So it's fairly easy. Apparently, there's not much to you know. You just point at something and put it, and then it yeah, and then it runs. This is the infinite cup from IKEA. Very, very special cup. I should check my emails before leaving. Okay. Computer. Mailbox. Test note. Important info. Inform. Password PBD. Test note. <laughs> Something. Wow. Oh. 100. My callow chicken in. Hey Joe, hope you're doing well. There's something in my mind that I've been wanting to talk to you about. I've been thinking about the pizzeria job and honestly, I feel a bit uneasy about it. Especially with those late hours. You've been watching the news lately, right? You might consider yourself responsible and capable, but let me make this explicitly clear. You don't need to be working there. We'll find another job for you and you will comply. Take care. I'll expect a call in the morning, Dad. Okay. What's going on? Hey Joe, what's up cuz? Time for another legendary night shift at the pizzeria. I know, I know. It's not exactly the hottest Saturday night plan, but hey, it's all in the name of keeping the family biz alive. Here's a lowdown. Dose prepped, so no need to stress about that. Just head into the kitchen when you're ready to rock and roll. Oh, and don't forget to load up on wood for the oven. It's been acting up lately. Orders will pop up on the computer, and if you draw a blank on what goes where, our trusted pizza recipe books on the desktop. I'll swing by in the morning to check in. It's gonna be a chill night. I also left you a voicemail at the pizzeria just to freshen up your memory once you get there. You got this. Later, Jimmy. Not spam at all. <laughs> hey there, are you still using floppy disk? Oh, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Great. Yeah, I remember all the fuss about Y2K back then. And do we just turn off the computer? I guess. What's this? Ah, okay. Turn it off. Someone's knocking at the door. Hey, 
Okay, the music was scarier than the view. But weird. What's in here? Oh, that's our toilet. Do we need to shower? I guess we're clean already. What's this? What? Why can't I use this? That's weird. Nothing else I can poke around on? I guess that's it. Let's go. Oh, why 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 would you do the noise when there's nothing out here? Damn it. These kind of hallways always creep me out a little bit. It's this time when the uh, hallway just whoop. We lock the door, right? Or we'll close it at least. Not that I think that we're gonna get robbed or anything, it just seems the right thing to do. But yeah, you always see those hallways that kind of zoom way out in the distance. Why is it so dark down at my door? Come on. So we're... We live on the sixth floor. Or... Seventh? Are we on way on the top? Eight, nine... We have a penthouse apartment. Nice. What the... Is that a mirror? Creepy. Okay, let's uh, let's go down to first floor, right? Why is it so quiet? I'm so used to games having music, and this quietness is just eerie. Ah, oh, okay. Tip. The stove has, has a mind of its own. Check it often. <laughs> okay, great. Phone. Hey, cuz, how are you doing? I'm good. Sam wanted me to call you and give you a quick rundown for your first night. Yeah? First thing you gotta do is grab the dough in the kitchen. We prepped it earlier, so you should be set for the night. Put it under the oven, throw in a log to start cooking. When someone makes an order, it will pop up on the computer. You also have the menu there in case you forget which ingredients go in each pizza. All right, that's it. I have to say, because you have some guts coming for the night shift. With all the stories about Tony, I wouldn't want to be there. Anyway, see you in the morning. So this is... I, I have never met or seen a pizzeria that was open at night. Uh, late night. <laughs> so yeah, that's interesting. Uh, pick up dough tray in the kitchen. How do we... Oh, okay. Dough tray. Bridge. So, me not having worked in a pizzeria. Stove off. We have a knife. No, we don't because we can't pick it up. <laughs> okay, fridge. Where's the... Ah, there we go. Pizza dough. How do we... Oh, like that. Okay, now we picked it up. Now what? We set it down here. Okay. Check the oven instruction on the computer. Is this... Oven guide. Pilova Calore 2000 pizza oven. Makes eggs like crispy pizzas. Press pizzas in a minute. Feels like professional work. It feels like professional work. It's not professional. It just feels like it. <laughs> Always hot. Okay. Uh, to reduce the risk of personal injury or property damage. Keep away from children and people will less like you than 100. Oh, that's... I'm way about that, frankly. Uh, do not add any petrol-based liquid directly in the oven. Do not attempt to climb inside the oven for any purpose while it's above. <laughs> Do not fall asleep while using the oven. This is where I could make some inappropriate American references. Uh, okay, add logs inside the oven and light them on. Check temperature using a temp gun. Between 4 and 460. 
pizza will cook in 60 seconds. Uh, okay. Good. I guess we'll give it a go. Oh, we can even watch a demonstration. <laughs> oh, magic. Mushrooms, mozzarella. Oh, so you can do it from far, you don't have to go all the way over there. But yeah, that was only 392, so he needs to create more. Oh, it heats up pretty fast, doesn't it? Eats a beal. Yum, yum. Get it cooking. Oh, we didn't even show sure percent this. Looks nice and tasty, right? Pizza box ready. Okay. Uh, and secret. Now, I'm curious. Let's try the password we had written in the... Uh... Ah. How about secret? Nah. Important. Maybe try something. Nah. Same mailbox. Okay. Cool. Throw three logs of wood in the oven. Oh, I actually didn't notice where he picked those up from. What the heck? Where did we get those? Do I have to find those somewhere? Open door. That's toilets. So dark in here. Trash bin. How did we... Where did it get the... Ugh, do we really have to see that again? Come on. Demonstration. Can we fast forward? We can just cut it off once we get to the uh, oh, once we get to the to the wood part. Oh, get past it. So the gun was oh, it was over there. So where did you get the wood? Ah, okay, below. Excellent. And that was even an arrow. Come on. And then we pick up the uh, gun here. Two ninety eight. Huh? Ah, I put it down automatically. So four. That's about right. Then we get. Oh, we got an order. Uh, orders. Linda. She wants one, and what, yeah, you want a pizza, what do you want on it? One, you? But I'm not, oh, Linda. <laughs> it's not a customer name, it's a pizza name. Tomato sauce, onion, mushrooms, I can do that. Uh, onions, mushrooms, is that it? Really? Nope, no cheese? Well, okay. I guess that's it. Then I guess we just gotta wait. Orders. So it will be picked up in eight and a half minutes. That's more than enough time, right? So I wonder when the horror part is going to start. <laughs> uh, 
Can we already like make pizza ready or dough ready? That would make sense, wouldn't it? And then, see efficiency. Almost done. I can't run. I can only walk. Nah, bully. They really put some effort into the uh, looks of this game. Okay. And then what? Drop the pizza in the kitchen on in the kitchen counter. So here. Oh, kitchen counter. I give the pizza to the delivery guy. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> He's a fast dude. Where did I put the pizza? Oh. Hello. <laughs> oh my god. A oh, phone. I still can't run. Hey, cuz, good job on your first pizza of the night. So Thank from you. From now on, you will get orders on the computer. Just take them as they arrive and try to get them all done. Yep. Okay. There are some other things I need to tell you. Oh? In the last couple of weeks, some weird stuff started happening, like kitchen equipment turning on by themselves, and we got a few leaks in the bathroom. If you ask me, I'm sure it's just some goofball who forgot to turn off water back there, but my mother insisted I brief you on this. <laughs> Simple no, stuff, really. Just check the kitchen and bathrooms for anything suspicious. Easy, right? Previous guy that worked the night shift, you know? The crazy dude that jumped off the roof said there were some ghosts messing around in the pizzeria. What the heck? Hey, we don't believe in ghosts, right, cuz? Um, nope. I guess we don't. Uh, at least not enough to jump off the roof. Let's see. Stagioni. Let's try and make that. Tomato sauce, mozzarella, pepperoni, and ham. Can I remember that? Uh, mozzarella, pepperoni. Did I put the pepperoni? I think I did. Okay. And what's the temperature on this guy? Ah, uh, it's a bit low, right? Ah, that's fine. Oh, we've got one more ready. Now we need a pepperoni pizza. Menu. Tomato sauce, mozzarella, pepperoni. Tomato sauce, mozzarella, pepperoni. Now, question is, I didn't set the timer. Oh my god. Well, I guess we're just gonna take it out about, take the other one out about halfway. Let's see how that goes. We only got those two running, right? Halfway, come on. Maybe a little more than halfway. Ah, that looks fine. What? No! Don't! Don't do that! It's not ready! Why would you do that? <laughs> oh no! Oh, we're gonna make it though without anything. I can't put it down now. What the heck? That's weird. Why can't I put it down? There we go. And the other one needs to come out. <laughs> oh my god, I forgot to close the lid on the box. 
move that. I'm doing a poor job. So where's the... Oh, it's... What the heck? Oh, no. The pepperoni pizza is doomed. Ugh. I guess we gotta trash it. And then we can put this in the window, right? Why? Why can't I do that? Okay. Never mind. What? Let's fire alarm? What the heck? Okay. Ghosts are already busy. Mozzarella and pepperoni, right? <sighs> and then turn this on. And then we're gonna take this shitty pizza. Oh, we do have a trash can. Good. Wow. Sorry, cuz. I messed up a pizza. Yeah, steak only. It's gonna be collected in five minutes. Do we even have enough heat? Oh my god. <laughs> Cook. Now let's see if we can uh, move this pizza. We can't move it yet, I guess, because he's not here. So we'll just wait. More dough. Did, did it? I didn't hear it. Was it wasn't finished? Well, oh, let's try again then. Ah. I mean, is this not hot enough? It's fine. Why is it not letting me put it in the box? Hmm. Four minutes. Oh, I think it's done now. So the mozzarella needs to be... What? Oh my god, how can I miss... No, don't pick it up. I really just... Oh my god, why is it so hard to make a pizza? Okay. Here we go. Pizza. Oven. Turn on timer. Please work. Now, take this. Put in trash. There we go. Now I'm gonna stare at the clock. And make sure it doesn't stop. I'm watching you. Oh, is it hot enough? Whoops. Are you kidding? Oh, was it 400, right? Fifteen seconds. Watching both the clock and the pizza. Hopefully the mozzarella balls are gonna uh, melt anytime soon. There we go. Perfect. What? Why is it? Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna... My cousin is gonna be so mad at me. Uh Okay, well, we got... Oh, he's already here. Let's go and uh, meet him. He sounds like a little... little mosquito guy. 
Doot doot. Open. There he goes into the darkness. <laughs> Hello? 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 Yes, you're the new guy. The guy yeah. they picked to make the pizzas. Noticed <laughs> anything weird yet? I bet you have. What? See, I called you tonight because I was almost certain they wouldn't end the night shift. There is nothing more important to the Falcos than money, and you are now milking their golden cow. <laughs> I used to... Well, I used to make the pizzas during the night shift. They probably told you I was insane or other stupid lies about what made me do what I did. There are things happening. What did it do? And I can help you survive. Survive? Well, you could just run what? away and never look back. If you're even slightly like me, though, you want answers. How about yes. I help you stay alive while you pursue them? Uh, that sounds like a fair deal. Job failed. Oh my god. I'm so embarrassed. First shift, yeah, okay. Hey, Chris, how are you doing? Yeah, not wanted me to call too you great. To give you a quick rundown for your first night. Yeah. First oh. <laughs> Rude, but we know what to do cuz don't sweat it. We are going to make it right this time. Oh my god. Okay, look how fast and efficient I am. We already know the oven instructions. Yeah, checked. Next. Yeah, wood. Good. More pizza now, please. Linda. Oh, let's get a reminder of what the Linda was. Tomato sauce, onions, mushrooms. Tomato sauce. Onions. Mushrooms. Pizza. Oven. Timer. We got this. A bit of big. No, you know what? Let's keep it here this time. Lesson learned. Forty-five seconds. I guess we can just check the toilet, right? Since we already know now that there's something wrong. He said leak, but there's actually a faulty outlet here. Sink. Can't do anything. Men's room. I'm getting shivers just walking around out here. Oh, oh no. No way. Not going in there. Not yet. Close door. Just in time. Excuse me? It's because I didn't have enough heat, isn't it? But it's a three locks. Oh my god. Whoops. Ah, there we go. Make that pizza. I wonder if it was cooked a little bit and now it doesn't need as long. I guess we can just try and take it out uh, once in a while. Let's see if the box... The box does not agree. <sighs> Try again. Box does not agree. We have seven minutes. Can't go completely wrong. Yes! Wow, that was much better. We still, oh, we can't take it yet. Here comes the humming bee, the little mosquito guy, the crazy, oh yeah. Let's do some drifting. 
Beep beep. Here you go, my friend. Oops, forgot to close the bridge. And now Cuz is gonna call, right? Hey Cuz, good job on your Yeah, thanks. Ah. <laughs> Next in line, please. One pepperoni. Let's guess let's get this right. Sauce, mozzarella, pepperoni. Come on, I can't mess that up, really. Could we fill the login? Perfect. Almost. Is it me? Oh, there's one here and there. Wow. Cheapskates. Grab it, put it in. See, I clicked it and then it didn't do it. And then I clicked it again. It was trying to trick me. And then we can get the steggy only ready. Oops. The steggy only was sauce, mozzarella, pepperoni, mushroom and ham. That's what I meant wrong. Pepperoni, there's no comma. Pepperoni, mushroom, or ham. I read it wrong. Pepperoni, mushroom, ham. We're gonna wait till this one is done. And let's just see how the uh, heat is going. It's going fine. We're gonna take care of this one first, and then we're gonna grab the stegioni afterwards. Can't miss this. Are you kidding me? Okay. So we're gonna do it like this. Put that in the box. Turn that on. Don't do that. What? Are you kidding me? That was creepy. Just a little bit. What the heck? I'm not supposed to go out and check, am I? I want to... Do I? Oh my god. Now I'm getting the shivers. I didn't notice her the first time. Ugh. Just let me do my pizzas, please. And this time we didn't trash any pizza, so we should we should be okay, right? <gasps> oh my god, for freaking crying out loud, what the heck? <sighs> oh my god, my heart is racing. Oh, not the stove again. Why is it almost like it's crazier this time around than the first? Uh, please don't, don't be, don't be creepy. Did you see that? No, you, you don't give a hoot, do you? Okay. Hello? Hello? Yeah. Let me guess, you're the new guy. Yeah, so we know you're going to keep us alive, right? Perfect job. Woohoo! Okay, it's scary, but perfect. <sighs> Into the past is a sip a, a dream. Okay. Oh, come on, why these ah oh. oh, come on. Oh no, she's gonna be Okay. But she's gonna be she's gonna be waiting around this corner, right? Or oh, the next corner, or oh, the next corner. Oh my god. What the heck? Oh, come on. Ah, uh, 
why are we going in here? What's that? Am, am I supposed to go in the closet? I can't. Oh my god, please don't. No, I'm not gonna turn off that light. Jesus. Freaking out. What am I Oh, there's gonna be something here somewhere. This is. This is freaking scary. My own consolation right now is I'm not playing this in pitch night, dark night. Who makes buildings like these anyway? Okay, are we supposed to be in here or? I already turned that off. We can't do any more here. I'm not gonna... I can't even pull this, so... <sighs> We're supposed to go back? And you know, the worst part is that... Uh, I know she's gonna be here in a moment. Probably. So I shouldn't be scared, right? But I am. <laughs> oh my god. Let's just, yeah, let's just get out. Please? Please? No? Okay, this dream can end now. This dream can really end now. What the heck? That looks like my apartment door, right? What are we gonna do here? Something about that room. Maybe I missed something. I heard something. Chair. Oh, journal. Dear journal, in just seven weeks and three days, my fate will be sealed in marriage. Am I enough? Will I manage to be a good wife and mother? He doesn't like talking about the past. He's kind and considerate today, but what about tomorrow? Will I end up suffering like my mother? Could it be the dreaded Falco's curse? Whoa. Oh. Doomed to be a disheartening marriage and an ill-fated death. I miss our father so much. They also just celebrating at the pizzeria for my big day. Yet, even though I despise that place, it's every corner echoes of our family's disarray. The bricks may not be the same. The screw may rise me regardless, holding us accountable for past and future wrongs. I ache for him, but resent recalling him in this manner. Sadly, it seems the only way I can. Perhaps for the sake of one last goodbye, we shall gather there and feast so he can be with us. Annabella. Oh, um... Oh, no, 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 no. What? Oh, please don't do... Oh, my God. She's going to pop up. I'm sitting here with my eyes half closed. No. Oh. Wow, okay. It should be fine. <laughs> I should make some coffee. Wow, well, talk about deja vu. Well, I guess we're getting into a, what? Where's the coffee? Bread. Where? Where's my coffee? Can't pick up a cup. 
Why is it in here now? Oh. Wow. So I just eat the <laughs> workplace dinner. And I don't care about washing up. Yep. Seems about right. Drink. I should check my emails before leaving. Okay. Yeah, I guess. Ready for another night at pizzeria? I know it's not the most thrilling thing you could be doing, but it's all about keeping the family. Yeah, you t told me that already. Dough's not prepped, so you'll need to use the mixer. Thanks for that. Other orders will come in on the computer like always. And if you ever need a reminder about the recipes, check out the recipes on the desktop. Yeah, okay. I'll swing by in the morning to take over. It's going to be a straightforward night. You got this. Mike Callow. I'm beyond furious about your recent actions. It's downright unacceptable. I've been your fuel, your sole supporter, guiding you after your mother's incident, and this is how you repay me? Is this some misguided attempt to challenge me or display ingratitude for everything I've done for you? Your behavior is disgraceful. Reflect on it and don't think for a second that there won't be. What? Your best bet against financial trouble. Who the hell? I hope you're doing well. I stumbled upon something pretty cool and just couldn't resist sharing it with you. I'll test a quick video for you to check out. Trust me, it's worth a watch. Oh, okay. Jimmy? Ah, yeah, okay. Ugh, who hasn't seen that by now? Ah! Yeah, thanks, cuz. <laughs> okay, let's get going, I guess. Anything else? Grab my car keys. Where do I keep those? Oh. I should get to work. I'm gonna peek. Yeah, I know I didn't close the door this time. Uh, frankly, I just want to get going. <laughs> what? There's a... No! Go away! Go away! Go away! Oh, she's gonna pop up in my face now, just like that bloody video. I'm not gonna turn around. I'm not gonna turn around. She's not there. She's not there. Get in the freaking elevator! Get in the freaking elevator! Go, 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 go! Go, go, go! Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I'm such a chicken. No. No. Nope. I'm... Move. <sighs> I'm sorry. If you expected me to look at whatever could be up in the ceiling or something, I didn't exactly feel the mood. Ooh, because I'm counting on this, gonna be a lot more jump scares. I need to get what? Okay, great. On the ground garage. Is she going to be out here now as well? <laughs> oh, dark. No, 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 no. No! What? Okay. Where are we being taken? Uh... 
There's ghosts, but... Does it want me to read? Precious child. It te it's te if tears could build a staircase and memories a lane, I'd walk right up to heaven and bring you home again. Oh, that's a bit sad. Sorry. I can't help you, I guess. Where are you going? Do you want me to follow you? Oh, you want... Ah, oh, okay. I'm playing with a ghost child. Just perfect. Where? What now? <sighs> Where is he? Or she? Is it fun? Where do you go? This is just loading up to some kind of scary event. <laughs> Come on, you can do it. Yay. Good job. <laughs> yeah, saw that. Sorry. Oh, okay. That was kind of sweet. Um... Yeah, let's get going. Oh, we can push the ball. Well, let's get to the garage. Whew. Where is it anyways? I feel like I'm just following the lights right now. Go to the blinking. Seems like a stairway down. See, who is ordering pizza? The whole city is sleeping, and here I am walking as the only person in town. Yet, someone is ordering pizzas. Enter with a buy a card at all times. Let's see, Eugene, you know, okay. Let's find my car. Right click to call your car. can hear a slight honk. Getting closer. Oh. Is that a blue one? It was easy if you can remember the password. The ropes. Hey, cuz, good job yesterday. Customers were happy and we made some money. Good. It's not as good as it used to be, though, with all the stories about the family. Business isn't booming, to say the least. <laughs> all these ghost stories, and now the story with this guy that worked your shift. He said that he started seeing the ghosts following him home at night, like they were not happy he worked at the pizzeria. He was telling customers about it. Talk about bad publicity. Well, anyway, guess what, cuss? Today you'll have to make was some right. dough as we're running low. I took out all the ingredients already. Everything is in the kitchen. If you somehow forgot the recipe, it's on the computer. The password for the file is the year the pizzeria opened for the first time. I'm not going to give you a history lesson, as you should know, but I'm a nice <laughs> guy. I'll give you a clue. Check the storage room. Good luck. Oh, come on. Check the storage room. <sighs> okay, password, PVD, right? So we we did find the password. Oh, the recipe. Menu? No. Here? Mailbox? Mailbox is empty. Uh secret? No. So 
we need a year that the pizzeria started, so I could need to choose to go out and get a jump scare in the storage room. Is there no way we can see the year it started here somewhere, please? That would be much nicer. Does it say anything here? Can't tell. Nope. Damn it. Mamma Mia Pizzeria. Ah, okay. I guess there's no way around this dark storage room. Ah, here we go. What? Why it's just so dark? Oh my god. Where's the light? I can't. I can't see anything. What's this door? Ugh. Why is the ladder here? I'm not supposed to close the door, am I? Toolbox. I feel like there should be... Oh, is it that? Wait. Okay, let me just see if I can turn on the, uh, the gamma. Oh, yeah. That's what we're going to do. Save, resume. Ah, that helped a lot. Okay. The gamma was quite low, right? Um, 1970. Okay. Yeah, close that door. Ooh. Okay, secret. 1970. Woohoo! Falco's dough. Family secret recipe. If you do not belong to the Falco's family, please destroy this document immediately. Failing to comply will bring upon you all the wrath of our family. We will sue you, we will track you, and if you don't lose everything you ever cherished by then, we will end you. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna take a screenshot or snapshot with my phone. To remember this recipe. Haha, <laughs> got you game. Okay. Let's do this. Let's make some dough. It got pretty bright. Maybe I should turn it a little bit down. Maybe that's is that it? Maybe just settle for three. Like that. Yeah, then it's kinda not so dark and still a little bit spooky. Okay. Water. We carry water in buckets. 200 milliliters of water. How, how do I know? How do I know how much is in? I ha How? What? How would I know? Okay, no, never mind. Flour? Oh, it's it says right above. God damn it. 200 milliliters. No. Ah, oh, okay, that was too much. We're probably going to get banged in the head for that. Uh, 1,000 grams. There we go. 20 milligrams of Falco's yeast. And then 10 grams of salt. And then 50 milliliters of oil. Okay. Wow, it's quite uh, hyper realistic, this, uh, these graphics they got going here. So, this. Does it stop by itself? Quality 99%. Yeah, I know. I know.
So we're just gonna make six of these. And last one. Freshly made dough. Whoa, that was fast. Oh, we forgot to turn on the oven. Uh, if we put one more in, then it's probably going to fit right with the... Yeah, it's going to be ready when we have made the pizza. One mamas. Tomato sauce, mozzarella and onion. Okay. I think that's ready now, right? No? Wasn't it like 440? Oven guide. No, it's fine. 460. Let's do it. Wow, it's really coming in now. So we want one Kachoa menu, sauce, mozzarella, ham, and pepperoni. Sauce, mozzarella. Is it ham? Whoops. Ham and pepperoni. Well, I just closed my eyes by... Just gonna give this a little more time. How's the heat going? Still fine. Ready. I'm feeling more confident this time. <laughs> okay, let's see. And then one, another mamas. Okay. Maybe we should just have the menu open all the time. Sauce, mozzarella, and onion. No. No, 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 no. I was, I was slobby. Ugh. Sorry, cuz. Oops. There we go. <sighs> we're not gonna get... I hope we don't get fired for that one. At least we didn't uh, <laughs> deliver it. Get that to the counter and then we are almost done. Yep. Nothing spooky at all going on right now. Oh, the heat. Ah, oh, still good, thank god. I'm getting tinglings. I feel like something is about to happen. Oh, it's the delivery guy. Hey, dude. Three pieces this time. Yeah. Guys, 
safely. Okay, never mind. Sounds like a broken wine bottle. I'll go to the restroom and grab the mop. Where? Oh. That's a bit weird. No. Oh, it was. I can just see it through the. <sighs> yeah, time to clean up the mess. That was pretty easy. Yeah, almost too easy, right? Do I have to leave it out there? Can I just leave it here? Oh, I can just drop it like that. <laughs> Sneaky. No. I need to... Oh. Deep breath. Deep breath. What the heck? How did I get out here? That was weird. Have you ever wondered why there is nobody to be seen in the restaurant at night? Excluding you, I mean. The Falcos wouldn't step in the place at night. Did you notice how even the delivery guy wouldn't cross the door? They actually crafted the delivery window five years ago when Vince, the younger Falco kid, was still doing some deliveries himself. Huh. They are conscious of the wrongs passed down through their family's history and mindful of their own personal mistakes. I know who your father is. The fact you are working there is surprising to me. You may not have the name, but you do have the blood. Why did you come back? What do you seek? Are we friends or enemies? I guess we shall find out <laughs> That's a bit black and white. By the way, did you start dreaming yet? I call yes. Them dreams, but they're more than that. I do believe that dying there would kill you here. A word of advice when you're walking in these dark corridors. Try to stay in the light. We'll talk more tomorrow. I'm preparing something for you. Something that may help you get the answers you seek, or simply bring more questions. <laughs> oh my god. Well, well, four stars. That's good. Successful chef. Stay out of the dark. Oh my god. I guess this is just about moving then. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna die, I'm not gonna die. But see? That was what I was talking about, right? Those long corridors. If this doesn't give you the shivers, I want to know what you're eating for breakfast and dinner and lunch and I'm still trapped. What is this fog? Is this... are these ghosts? Or something? Or it's just dream atmosphere kind of? Again, with the radio, 909, at least it's not room 3237, no, was it? <laughs> Just the... F Where are we? Annabella again. Dear Journal, only a week remains before the grand day. We settled on the pizzeria for the celebration following the ceremony. I yearn for our father's presence, hoping to evoke even a fleeting moment of joy in him, as he once brought to us. Anxiety grips me, overshadowed by my sister's demeanor. Valentina's cries echo through the walls of the bathroom. She shields her emotions there, but her cries, louder than any I've ever known, reveal her inner turmoil. 
I attempted to console her, but she recoiled, sharing nothing. I suspect it's linked to her new lover. A relationship once radiant seems to have dimmed in these recent days. I wish I could ease her pain, shielded her from it. I'll keep trying, I must. Seems like Annabella had a lot of challenges. Coffee won't keep her away, but it's very tasty. Accidents happen. I should make some coffee. <laughs> it's actually quite interestingly made this game because the repetition kind of makes you anticipate. You have an idea of what you think is going to happen. And yeah, that kind of makes me shiver a little bit. Did we put the coffee back? What the heck? Ah, why do we keep changing the location for these beans? Still haven't eaten the bread here. We didn't smoke yet either, so that's good. We're probably trying to quit, aren't we? But, oh my god. Seriously? This was like one day? Yeah. Let's check the emails. Mm. <sighs> Final arrangements for Gina. Dear Fakos, I'm writing to inform you about the necessary steps we're taking for Gina's final arrangements. As the director, it's my responsibility to handle this matter with respect and care. Following lo local protocols and consulting with the authorities, we've ensured the problem and legal disposal of Gina's remains. We've collaborated with the necessary parties to carry out this task. Please know that every measure has been taken to handle this situation with the utmost care and respect for Gina. Our decision aims to provide closure and honor for her memory appropriately. During this challenging time, please accept our deepest, deepest sympathies. We understand death can be hard and here to answer any questions, provide additional details if needed. Sincerely... Can't even read it. Damn it. But it's from... Peace Domain? <laughs> Now we grab our cell phone. Laundry. I need to do the laundry at the laundry right across the street. Ah, uh, okay. Time to peek a little bit. What, can I peek, please? Oh, let's. Yeah, she's not gonna be here this time, right? Huh. Could you be any slower? Please don't. Was oh, she going to be in the elevator? I swear to God. Oh. oh, come on, four. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, okay. It's better to bring your own money. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Okay, laundromat time. Across the street, I guess this is this way then. Must be over here. I like that it's so bright in here. We can work with that. Mm, 
find laundry detergent. Good evening, listeners. This is Miles with the latest developments unfolding in our town. Tonight marks a grim milestone as the prominent packing plant in our community shuts its doors and ceases operations. Coin coins? That's right, folks. The 17th closure in just three short months, leaving behind vacant buildings and silent streets. The downturn continues, with businesses like the packing plant closing down and the local economy on the verge of collapse. Oh. On another note, meteorological. Oh, that's looked like five, but it was actually just one. In an attempt to identify the origin of the fog surrounding the town. Origin of the fog? What was that? No. That door was closed. I lost the keys to this door. Can you find it by Monday? I think it's in one of the washers. Huh. Thanks for the tip. Uh, it sounds like someone's in here. Let's see. Uh, there's probably not going to be any more money on the floor in here. It's probably in that locked room, isn't it? Maybe we could go check washers. Can't I can't really look into it. Oh, now she's going to come crawling up this one, isn't she? They had these coins, but I, I need to find the coins. No keys. Hmm. That's gonna be something in god damn it. It's just perfect setup for something scary here. No keys. No coins. No coins at all. Hey, that's closed. I could drink that. No, never mind. Oh, office. Well, guess that's mine. Now. <sighs> Placeholder. Oh, computer. Cans. Quit smoking in 10 days. That's fast. Okay, well. Oh no. There she is. She looking at me. Well, that was only, I'm still missing one coin. Am I supposed to go out after her and then we're gonna find the last coin, maybe? Maybe we're gonna find it in here. Locked. Why is there a locked door? Oh, disgusting. No. Why? Oh, she's going to come crawling over. Just... Oh my god. This is so creepy. Okay, let's just get this done. <laughs> this is... 
How do I answer my phone? Hey, cuz. Sorry for calling you on your cell phone. I just wanted to check in and see how you're doing. Yeah? You got the email about Gina. Uh, I mean, your mom, right? I know it's been weeks since, you know, but I still can't believe she's gone. I didn't really see her that much. Most of my time with her was after the incident with Annabella, and I was very young. Growing up, she was just a happy old woman. I don't know you that well, cuz, but one thing's for sure. I know she meant a lot to you. I'm sorry she had to go the way she did, and that you didn't get to spend much time with her before everything happened. I understand how tough your father can be, and I also respect the courage it takes to go against his authority to work in the family business. It's just surprising, you know? Out of all people, why would you want to come work here? I guess I should just mind my own business, eh? Keep doing what you're doing. <laughs> well, to be honest, it sounds like you guys have been having a really shitty time. Oh my god, yeah. Why would I work for you? Unexpected turn. I want to apologize about yesterday. The mysterious play around friend or enemy is not the yeah. kind of thing I usually do. I guess I just wanted to know where you were standing, hoping I could get some words out of you. <laughs> I'm still puzzled about the reason of your presence. Let me give my best guess. You probably feel like your father is holding you from this heritage, this family that should be yours as well. Gina, she was your mother too. Bat crazy, sure, but still your mother. Bat crazy? And once upon a time, your father's You mind your mouth now, young man. Gone. Who wouldn't go crazy after suffering two distinct deaths? First your husband, then one of your daughters. Terrible tragedies uh, okay. that twice in the same location. May also explain why your father is so scared. But see, there is more to the story. Annabella, she told me what happened. She shall tell you too, if you're ready to listen. When I was working at the pizzeria, I found a way to talk to her in a more passive manner. It's some sort of ritual. It's a way to communicate with spirits and ask them questions. I actually left all the props needed for the ritual back in the electric room. I Seriously? I for you to unveil some of the secrets of your family. Grab the stuff I left there, shut down the power, and get started. <laughs> I mean, you don't have to, but as I said before, I'll help you get the answers you seek. Are you ready to hear them, though? Yeah, I guess. Let's let's find out. Let's find out what's, what this family is all about. So, items for the ritual. <sighs> Here we go. Keep your peepers closed. Okay. I need to check the instructions for the ritual. So, that must be this, or... Ritual directions. May you swim in the blood of the shadow. May you live a full life enlightened by the sun. May the dead speak to you in the darkness. May the truth be revealed by the burning light. Okay, so one, two, three, four. So top, left, right, bottom, left, right. Blood, death, life, balance, truth. Ah, okay, I think I get it now. Blood of the shadow. So one, one blood, live a life full enlightened, full life enlightened by the sun. One blood, two life, three death, four truth. One blood, two life, three death, four truth. So how do we do this? Oh, that's four. So this is... What do I do? Oh, I gotta remember the symbols. Okay. So death, a blood. Blood is like an X maybe? Crazy X. Uh, this one. And then 
may you live a life life is uh what's that kind of like an alien or something <laughs> And then death is very squarish. And then we got truth. Whoops. Truth is like boobs, which is true. Boobs are truth. And that should be it, right? I should sit at the table. Not ready. Did I miss something? What about balance? I can't sit. Uh, did I miss something up? I feel like it's the right way. But maybe it's not. So blood, life. What was the the last one was balance? But is there any balance in the text? No. So maybe it's a placement that's wrong. So if we look at the table. I bet that little square is the book. So that means one is blood. It should be right. Why is it not? Well, I guess it's not right, so... Um, what can we do? Oh, this is the table. Uh, may you swim? Full life. And then death. May the dead speak to you in the darkness. May the death speak to you in the darkness. May the truth be revealed by the burning light. Huh. That's that truth and death. Oh, am I facing the wrong way? Because it's going like this. So maybe, yeah, okay. So I was looking at it opposite. So this might be life, which was this one. And this one will then be not boobs, but... Uh, the X, and then boobs go here, or that must be, th is that three? Let's have a look. Dead, no, that's four, so that's true, oh, that is boobs. And then we got uh, death here, which was the squarish one, right? Ritual not ready. Ah, damn it. Okay. Hmm. We're gonna figure this out. We're gonna figure this out. One, two, three, four. Let me swim in the blood of the shadow. Blood X. May you live a full life enlightened by the sun. Life is that one. Try again, that one. May the dead speak to you in the darkness. Three. That's this one, it is this one. And then truth. Oops. Wow, okay, this is silly. What am I missing here? What is that little square? 
Am I looking at it wrong? Four dots and then... We swim in the blood of the shadow. It looks like a swimmer, right? Two, three. May the dead speak to you in the darkness. Am I supposed to turn off the lights? What else could it be? Ritual table not ready. I mean, we could just try and flip those to other spots or positions. But it does, just doesn't make sense to me. Because the square, the little square, I think that's a note of the book. So it, I sh it should be right, right? Okay, let's just try and see what happens. Not ready. Well, obviously, and alien and then uh this is boobs and this is the square one not pretty am i doing uh. may the truth be revealed by the burning light May the dead speak to you in the darkness. Is that because that means it doesn't say death, doesn't it? Does it? It says dead. So it's not death, it's balance because dead and balance, maybe. Let's try that. So we're going to make this. That was the X, right? Swim blood. This is life. This is boobs. And this is balance, which was that one. No. Four is truth. Blood, life. May you live a full life enlightened by the sun. Very tricky, this. May the dead speak to you in the darkness. I can't, I can't figure out what I'm doing wrong here. What if I approach it from this side? It still flips me around. So should this be death and the other one boobs? What? Oh, that freaked me out a little bit. <laughs> and then then we we'll try and use boobs on this one. Still not ready. This is really bugging my brain. Blood. Life. Death. And... Truth. Truth boobs. I can't do anything here. Oh, it's obvious. The, the, the signs are right, but here's what we're going to do. No? Oh. Darkness. No? Really? May you swim in the blood? Oh, 
we can't turn these off yet. So this is this should be right. X life death. And then do we need to light one of them? May the truth be revealed by a burning light. So that and that needs to be turned on as well, maybe. And oh truth needs to be turned on, maybe. And number two, all life. So this one. Not this one, that's darkness, and this is turned on. Ah. <sighs> when did you die? How old are you? Only to close your eyes. Ah. <laughs> uh. What? Close your eyes with E while she's writing the answer. And the tip says, keep your peepers closed. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. We uh, learned that the hard way. So, oh, and we can turn that off. And then we're gonna get life. Keep that burning. Truth. Boops. And. Death. And then we're not going to look at... Not ready. Oh, did it, did it change? I mean, it does speak to you in the darkness. It's the same. Why is it not ready? Oh, it is ready. How old are you? No peeping this time. Oh, this game should have been played with headphones. It's not going to say where I can open my eyes. I feel like I... Okay, she's done writing. Can I open now? 20. Uh, are you trying to kill me now? What do we want? Okay, I think we're ready. Vengeance. Okay. Uh, why are you following me? Family. Ooh, let's read the note. Dear Journal, how does one bear a secret capable of shattering a family? Why am I burdened with such a dreadful truth? Last night in the stillness, I heard noises from outside. I, ex I expected Valentina sneaking out to rendezvous with her lover. Concerned for my sister led me to eavesdrop. That's when I saw him standing there. What was his purpose? Had he noticed her slipping away? Then everything shifted. Valentina attempted to kiss him. She tried to kiss Mike. She expressed a deep desire to keep something. A child, perhaps? This revelation could tear our family apart. I can't allow Mike to do this to us. I have resolved to confront him before the wedding. He must depart from my family. Our mother, my sister, they deserve better. Okay. Now what? Closets are also always safe. 
Uh, we're having another dream. Oh, we don't drill. Stay out of darkness. Oh. Keep moving. Find that room again. Nine oh nine again. I'm scared. Today is my wedding, but I can't shake the feeling that something terrible is about to happen. Yesterday, the night after I confronted Mike, he came to my room. The second he entered, my blood froze. A distinct liquor stench flooded my room, making me nauseous. He was furious. I was scared for my life. He threatened me. He said he'd destroy me if I said anything to anyone. He said he'd do it again if he needs to. I don't know what he meant by that, and I was scared to know. I need to stand against him for my family. I can't let him go on with this. Valentina deserves better. My mom deserves better. He will be the end of our family. Hide in the closet. Annabella? No. Annabella's not here. Annabella's not here. Jesus. Don't lick the walls. Gotcha. Bloody truth. Coffee? Yep. What a mess. Tried all the cupboards soon. Ah, uh, well, that's not necessary. Jesus. Oh my god. Yeah. Thanks, ghost. Can I can I can I close please? What? Oh. Ah. <sighs> well. Guess I can wait with Wait with cleaning that up till later. <laughs> Just like this. Floor and counter matches. I'll grab my keys, sure. I have my phone. Time to go to my favorite place. What's that? Is that the pizzeria? <laughs> ah, yeah. The illusion of safety. People. Oh, nah, hell no. Ah, oh, come on. Oh, are we gonna look? Are we gonna peep? <sighs> oh, man. <laughs> I feel like that guy, that Mike guy, could be helping us a lot more than he is. I wonder what happens if we press a different button. Oh, maybe we'll try that next time. Lights off and turn. Lights off and turn. Yeah, okay, let's go. We're gonna get jumped again by the child ghosts. Do you know you're part of the five percent of the population that currently has a cell phone? What? Some researchers speculate that we'll all own one at some point. I'm not well, sure about that, to be honest. I yeah. feel like we're losing something. Feels like talking to the dead to me. <laughs> That's not why I called you. I think the ritual yesterday got Annabella quite disturbed. I'm assuming you've already seen a few things that are out of place. Oh. This is only the start. Well, you told me to do it. A little it. bit of advice here, as you probably remember from the ritual. Annabella doesn't like to be looked at. If you get in a situation where you're facing her, just turn off any light source and look the other way. That's probably the only way you'll get her to leave you be. Well, that's mostly theory. You'll know if it works soon enough. <laughs> great. That's great. Oh, 
Oh. So you sold me. Yeah, now we're gonna get a flashlight. Oh, God. It's not even lighting the way. <laughs> Oh my god! What the? She caught you. Don't let her get you. Okay. <laughs> Lights off and turn. Ah, oh, come on. This place. Do you know you're part of the 5% of the population that currently has a Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some researchers speculate that we're going to some point. I'm not sure about that, to be honest. I feel like we're losing something. Feels like talking to the dead to me. So, if That's I'm hearing that tinkling music, I'm gonna turn off the light and then I'm assuming turn 180 on her. <laughs> this is only the start. A little bit of advice here, as you probably remember from the ritual. Annabella doesn't like to be looked at. Yeah, we just found out. Facing her, just turn off any light source and look the other way. That's probably the only way you'll get her to leave you be. Well, that's mostly theory. You'll know if it works. <sighs> it's interesting how they, the whole horror genre managed to make pizzicato violence be scary like that. How do we turn off the light? Oh, like that. Jesus. Oh my God. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, get in that bloody car. <laughs> Decisions. Hey Joe, I am sorry, but this is going to be your last night. I know this what? is important for you, but I have to think of my mother. Yesterday, your father showed up at our doorstep and he threatened my mother. He said really horrible stuff and things he would do to her if we don't fire you. I just think you okay. should know that stuff. Your father can't do that without consequences. I was really scared yesterday, and my mom was too. After he left, she cried all night. She seemed so scared, I don't know what he said to her to make her so afraid. You know, it's always been difficult for my mother. When I started working back at the pizzeria, I was happy because I felt like I could finally support her and bring a bit of peace in her life. She never complained or said anything, but I know it's been hard for her to raise me on her own. From the moment I was born, she was all alone, and she never gave up on me. I'm telling you that in hopes that you understand my decision. Yeah, well. You and I, we never got too much time yeah, together. I don't so completely feel like you're being fair. honest, and this place creeps me out anyways. You deserve to be part of our family as much as anyone else. Tonight will be your last night. Just make sure to close the shop once you're done with the orders, and I'll come grab the keys tomorrow. Take care, cuz. Hmm. Well, I guess we we'll might as well end in a good way. We already got pizza going. Kachoa. One. I guess we'll go and grab the uh, dough. And of course they didn't make any. Oh my god. So. Nice. Nice of you. One last night. Well, water. 200. Perfect. Falco's flower. That's 1000. And then we need the yeast. And then we need the salt, which was 10. 
And then we need the oil, which was 50. Make it. Good. Turned over glasses. Huh. Put that here. About three pizzas now. So let's get the first one. Menu orders. What's a cachua? Oh, no. Pepperoni. Oh, they're trying to trigger us. But well, we are in a hurry then. Sauce, mozzarella, pepperoni. And then the next one is... Four stagioni. So does it mean four of those? Oh, it's just name. Sauce, mozzarella, pepperoni, mushroom, ham. Pepperoni, mushroom, ham. Pepperoni, mushroom, ham. Pepperoni, mushroom, ham. Mm-hmm. Two minutes. We can do this. Let's just put this one in. And then get this ready for the delivery guy. I can't even take it yet. One minute. Is he gonna come by soon? I bet he's gonna come just as a timer buzzes. Well, what's the temperature of this? That's fine. 15 seconds. Don't you come at that time. 44 seconds. And we needed a, a cachorro, which is mozzarella, ham, and pepperoni. Why is he not coming? So I should have made all of those at the same time, probably. Yeah, uh, oh, come on. Could I even have fit three in there? Oh, I could have fit two, and then I could have put in the last one. Ah, well. Hopefully they won't get too mad. <laughs> Besides, I don't like Jimmy anymore. 
He's been... He's not been nice. I guess you just gotta drive a little faster. Beep beep. Now what? No orders. Oh yeah, we got a new one. Mamas. What's a red and onion? I think it's not burning hard enough, is it? And then we want a Linda. Onion and mushrooms, no mozzarella. How long is it? About halfway. <laughs> and then we're just gonna set the timer once more and then let it go halfway, roughly. Should we get the right one? Let's put that there and then we gonna get the other one. Maybe like 27, 26, 27. Don't get burned. I'm telling you. Oh, thank God. Come get pizzas. It's pretty fast, actually, isn't it? pizzas come in or can I make should I make some dough oh my god stegioni see we're gonna have a problem now if there are gonna be more orders <gasps> oh my god so mozzarella pepperoni mushroom ham mozzarella pepperoni mushroom ham mozzarella Rony, mushroom, ham. For 20. Whoops, we got, forgot the clock. Let's see if we can make some dough. Oh, come on. We should have made more dough. Nope. Oh. That was almost a beat, wasn't it? <laughs> Ah, not gonna be perfect. Caprichosa and Kachoa.
Gotta get the dough. This is turning into a simulation game rather than a horror. <laughs> But look how pro we are now. And then Annabella's come and gonna come and fuck it all up. Okay. Menu. Whoops. Capricciosa. Mozzarella, ham and mushroom. Mozzarella, ham and mushroom. And what was the last one? That was a couture. Which was mozzarella, ham, and pepperoni. Mozzarella, ham, and pepperoni. So that was in around... It's going to get an extra 23 seconds, maybe. Should I make more dough already? Can I, can I make that? Let's try. See what happens. We got this recipe down to a T now. Unless I'm going to click too fast. Oh, shit. Oh, we made it. Thank God. And then hopefully it just about fits with this one. Wow, that was pro. No. Oh, he got them. Well, good. This one is going. Oh, the phone. Before you go, I'd like to tell you a story. Sure. My story. My name is Lucas Dimas. I started Lucas. working in the pizzeria a few months ago. It started fine, just like any restaurant gig, if you skip the weird delivery window. After a few days, though, I started seeing things. At first, it was just some pans falling for no apparent reasons. Gas stoves being turned on, oven getting ice cold minutes after I would light it. After the first week, she showed herself to me, Annabella. She was so gorgeous beautiful in her own sadness. I felt driven to learn more about her, to share more time. I was fascinated. How could a ghost make me feel so much? I started dreaming, like you did. It felt good. I wanted to feel more. That's when I came up with the ritual. That's when she told me her story. What your father did to her. What he did to the family. With time, I couldn't do anything but fall deeper in love with her. Then one day, she guided me through a dream. At least, I thought it was a dream. After my jump, I opened back my eyes, and I was back at the restaurant. I had a new purpose. She told me to wait, that you'd come soon, and that we needed to show you the way. I'm trapped now, the same way she is. You can still what? correct it. You have the power to burn this place down. What? Let us rest for eternity. You can also <laughs> walk away and abandon your family. So what is it going to be? See you in another dream, friend. Light the stove burns, burn down the pizzeria, or leave through the front door. Well, should we should we just avenge Annabella and help Lucas? I think we should, shouldn't we? I think my cars just uh, used me. Escape the pizzeria! Go go go!
Wow, why, why would she try to trap me? <laughs> Jesus. Annabella, why are you doing this? Seriously? Why I was helping you? No! No, no, no! Come on! You can catch me! Ah! <laughs> uh, don't let her get it! What? The back door is a safe option. Oh my god. Hey Joe, I am sorry, but this is going to be your last night. Fuck you, Jimmy. We're gonna get nail this portion straight on. Mm-hmm. And then we're gonna see if we can get all the pizzas done in the same time. Now, so far, only one. That's manage manageable. Okay. So we got three minutes to make a kachoa, two kachoas, mozzarella, ham, pepperoni. There we go. That was in about 10 seconds, so it just needs a little bit more time. Mamas. So in the time we place this, the other one will be ready, roughly. And then we hurry up and make mamas. With 126 to go, we're gonna make this.
I think we made it. Three dose to spare. No, oh, already. Mamas. Come on, just a little bit more. <clears throat> there we go. Okay. Please let this be it. <laughs> please, please, please. Nice working with you. Take care. Please, no more pizzas. Lucas, please just call. Oh, come on. <laughs> Dagioni, mozzarella, pepperoni, mushroom and ham. And then we got a mamas as well. We need to make more dough anyways, Gibbous. No mistakes this time. Now we got this. Fifteen seconds. What else we get? A Linda and a Mamas. Cut, 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 cut. How much dough would a dough dough chuck? No, that doesn't quite work. <laughs> what was it we needed? We needed uh, mamas. Then a Linda. Onions, sauce, onions, and mushrooms. No mozzarella. Sauce, onions, mushrooms. Twenty-five. Okay.
Da, da, da. Hello and welcome to the application um, test for Domino's Pizza. I feel like the fire wasn't burning hard enough, was it? <gasps> Maybe it wasn't. Oh my god, I hope it doesn't go wrong. Oh no. Uh, we need to let this one sit a bit more. But we could turn it on again for the other one. Damn it. I guess these two are going to be ready roughly the same time. But we got the mozzarella balls to be a little tattletale. Oh, there we go. And then we can take the other one out as well, maybe? Seems about right. Phew! Lucky me. Get in here. Okay, this has got to be it, right? Please call now, Lucas, so we can get this job over with. Oh, thank you. You heard my prayers. Yeah. My name is Lucas Dimas. I started working in the pizzeria a few months ago. Yeah, we're gonna burn the place down, Lucas. Just like any restaurant gig. It's yeah, we're gonna weird we're gonna burn it down. After a few days, we're gonna burn it down. I started seeing things. That's At fine. First, it was just some pans falling for no apparent reason. No. So, Let's drink a bottle of wine while we wait. Oh, we can't. Feels like shit. Oh, they got IPA. Nice for a summer drink. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Can I crawl in the oven? Well, we can't jump or anything. With time, I couldn't do anything but fall deeper in love with her. Then one that's, day, that's, she got that's, 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 that's okay. I get it. I totally After get it. my jump, I opened back my eyes, and I was back at the restaurant. I had a new purpose. She told me to wait, that you'd come soon, and that we needed to show you the way. I'm trapped now, the same way she is. You can still correct it. You have the power to burn this place down. I'm actually There's talking a to a dead guy right now. That's... You can also walk yeah. away and abandon your family. So what is it going to be? See you in another dream, friend. We are gonna burn... the house down. The house is on fire. We are gonna do our best to get the hell out of here. <laughs> ah! Oh my gosh, he's so creepy. The back door, was it? No tips here, you're stuck in the back of a car. <laughs> what? The car, right? You burned the pizzeria and escaped, and the investigation was opened after the incident. Your father owned this place. He has since disappeared. It's been a week now. It's late and you're tired. You fall asleep one last time. Okay. Great. This... You realized what you did? I don't need this kind of heat right now. This is terrible for my business. I shouldn't blame you. It's my fault. Is it that? I didn't educate you properly. But don't worry. Soon enough, you'll understand the meaning of respect. What? We're going back there, and I'm going to teach you a few things. What do you mean? Going back there? <laughs> what? I feel... I feel inconclu inconcluded. What the heck? 
So what is that going to do to us? I mean, the place is burned down. Is he going to turn us into the, to the cops? Oh my god. Oh well. Well, that was a Tony, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.